Okay, on some, on some cylinders, you'll have specifications like this. As they bored the cylinders on this engine, there may have been some variation in the bores after they were done, and so they mark them as cylinder mark one, mark two, or mark three, sometimes uh, mark A, mark B, and mark C. You'll see they each have slightly different specifications, not much. We're looking at about uh, two to three ten thousandths of an inch difference between these three different sizes here. But uh, you'll say, which specification do I use? So you come over to the engine block, and stamped into the engine block, that cylinder's been marked as a two, a two, a one, and a two. And so you would measure that cylinder compared to that specification. Sometimes you'll find these stamped on the bottom rail of the engine block, but uh, you know maybe, maybe like right in this area. But you watch for those numbers to tell you how they are, and all it is, is is variation in the machining process. When they got done machining them, they they measured the cylinders and found that some are slightly bigger than others, and labeled each cylinder accordingly. And this one says two, 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 two. So all four of the cylinders here fit specification number two, and that's just something to be aware of. I'm going to go back together. What we're trying to do is fit the uh, pistons to the cylinders. If it's a number two piston, we want to put it into a number two cylinder, and so on.